Guys, before you watch this video, you've got to watch part one so you don't miss a thing. Orlando Brown takes Raven Simone down a dark and dangerous path and he's not turning back. There are two sides to every story, but there's only one backstory. Raven Simone and Orlando Brown both stood lifeless like frozen statues trapped in time. The feds incessantly knocked on the door. What did we do? What did we do? The carefree expression on Orlando Brown's face obscured the depth of pain in his eyes. Raven, once they take my phone, don't talk to anyone, not even your wife. You're scaring me, dude. Raven, fear is like a shadow looming menacing until you decide to turn on the light and it dissipates. The door burst open. A school of FBI agents surrounded Orlando. What's up, fellas? Where's his phone? With brute force, the agents led Orlando out the door. The very next morning, Raven followed Orlando's instructions and went to the nail shop on Slauson Street. The shop was void of any life. Hello? Anyone here? A woman in a red bob entered from the back. Her eyes were tense and eager. Are you Dorothy? Fear forced the woman a few steps back. How do you know my name? Orlando said you have a video I need to see. Dorothy looked over Raven with a disapproving glare. I don't know what you're talking about. Raven pleaded politely. Are you sure? Yes, I'm very sure. Raven turns on her heels and headed for the exit. Wait, follow me to the back. Raven followed the woman in the red bob to a room in the rear of the store. I met Orlando years ago. He actually saved my life. He knows where all the bodies are buried. Raven grew impatient. Tell me about who's on the video. They came last night and confiscated my phone. But who was on the video? Dorothy swiveled around, revealing an incision in her neck. What's that? Some would say it's the mark of the beast. I like to call it Lady Liberty. It's the new government program rolling out in 2025. Raven took an exhausting breath and tried gathering her thoughts. I don't know why I'm on Slauson in the middle of the day talking to a woman I don't know who may or may not be telling me the truth. Believe what you want, Raven and your passport is in the brown cabinet second drawer underneath your birth certificate. Raven's eyes stretched wide with wonder. How did you know what I was 